What is the term for an animal that eats only plants? What is the term for an animal that eats only plants? Herbivore. What do we call the study of past events? What do we call the study of past events? History. What is the term for a baby cat? What is the term for a baby cat? Kitten. What do you call the building where movies are shown? What do you call the building where movies are shown? Cinema. What is the term for a group of stars forming a recognizable pattern? What is the term for a group of stars forming a recognizable pattern? Constellation. What do you call the first meal of the day? What do you call the first meal of the day? Breakfast. What is the term for the fear of heights? What is the term for the fear of heights? Acrophobia. What do you call a professional who repairs and installs water pipes? What do you call a professional who repairs and installs water pipes? Plumber. What is the term for a person who writes for newspapers or magazines?
What is the term for a person who writes for newspapers or magazines? Journalist. What do you call the place where bees are kept? What do you call the place where bees are kept? Apiary. What is the term for the science of plants? What is the term for the science of plants? Botany. What do you call a severe snowstorm with high winds? What do you call a severe snowstorm with high winds? Blizzard. What is the term for the imaginary line that divides the Earth into northern and southern hemispheres? What is the term for the imaginary line that divides the Earth into northern and southern hemispheres? Equator. What do you call the study of human societies and cultures? What do you call the study of human societies and cultures? Anthropology. What is the term for a piece of land surrounded by water? What is the term for a piece of land surrounded by water? Island. What do you call the outer layer of a tree? What do you call the outer layer of a tree? Bark. What is the term for a building where art is displayed? What is the term for a building where art is displayed? Gallery. What do you call the person who leads an orchestra?
What do you call the person who leads an orchestra? Conductor. What is the term for the study of the weather? What is the term for the study of the weather? Meteorology. What do you call a long, narrow ditch filled with water for defence? What do you call a long, narrow ditch filled with water for defence? Moat. What is the term for the time when the sun is farthest from the equator? What is the term for the time when the sun is farthest from the equator? Solstice. What do you call a drawing or painting of a person? What do you call a drawing or painting of a person? Portrait. What is the term for a person who studies rocks and the earth? What is the term for a person who studies rocks and the earth? Geologist. What do you call a large group of fish swimming together? What do you call a large group of fish swimming together? School. What is the term for the science of classifying living things? What is the term for the science of classifying living things? Taxonomy. What do you call the protective covering on the end of a finger? What do you call the protective covering on the end of a finger? Fingernail.
What is the term for the smallest particle of an element? What is the term for the smallest particle of an element? Atom. What do you call a group of musicians playing together? What do you call a group of musicians playing together? Band. What is the term for a small river or stream that flows into a larger one? What is the term for a small river or stream that flows into a larger one? Tributary. What do you call the person who checks and corrects written text? What do you call the person who checks and corrects written text? Editor. What is the term for a journey by sea or space? What is the term for a journey by sea or space? Voyage. What do you call a place where bread and cakes are made or sold? What do you call a place where bread and cakes are made or sold? Bakery. What is the term for the art of arranging flowers? What is the term for the art of arranging flowers? Floristry. What do you call a large wild cat with a tawny coat and black spots? What do you call a large wild cat with a tawny coat and black spots? Leopard. What is the term for a large body of salt water smaller than an ocean?
What is the term for a large body of salt water smaller than an ocean? Sea. What do you call a scientist who studies the stars and planets? What do you call a scientist who studies the stars and planets? Astronomer. What is the term for a person who designs buildings? What is the term for a person who designs buildings? Architect. What do you call the act of traveling from one place to another? What do you call the act of traveling from one place to another? Journey. What is the term for a device that shows the direction of magnetic north? What is the term for a device that shows the direction of magnetic north? Compass. What do you call a person who makes or repairs shoes? What do you call a person who makes or repairs shoes? Cobbler. What is the term for the art of public speaking? What is the term for the art of public speaking? Oratory. What do you call the large machine used for lifting and moving heavy objects? What do you call the large machine used for lifting and moving heavy objects? Crane. What is the term for a government ruled by a king or queen? What is the term for a government ruled by a king or queen? Monarchy. What do you call a person who plays the piano?
What do you call a person who plays the piano? Pianist. What is the term for a place where animals are kept for the public to see? What is the term for a place where animals are kept for the public to see? Zoo. What do you call the process of teaching and learning usually at school? What do you call the process of teaching and learning usually at school? Education. What is the term for a long journey involving travel by sea or in space? What is the term for a long journey involving travel by sea or in space? Odyssey. What do you call a game in which two or four players hit a shuttlecock over a net? What do you call a game in which two or four players hit a shuttlecock over a net? Badminton. What is the term for a picture or pattern produced by arranging together small coloured pieces of hard material? What is the term for a picture or pattern produced by arranging together small coloured pieces of hard material? Mosaic. What do you call the person who collects tickets on a bus? What do you call the person who collects tickets on a bus? Conductor. What is the term for a person who competes in sports? What is the term for a person who competes in sports? Athlete. What do you call the practice of growing plants and vegetables for food? What do you call the practice of growing plants and vegetables for food? Gardening. What is the term for the removal of trees from a forested area?
What is the term for the removal of trees from a forested area? Deforestation. What do you call a large building where sports or entertainment events are held? What do you call a large building where sports or entertainment events are held? Stadium. What is the term for a period of 100 years? What is the term for a period of 100 years? Century. What do you call a person who studies or practices law? What do you call a person who studies or practices law? Lawyer. What is the term for a list of dishes available at a restaurant? What is the term for a list of dishes available at a restaurant? Menu. What do you call a person who plays a musical instrument as a profession? What do you call a person who plays a musical instrument as a profession? Musician. What is the term for a book in which an individual or a photographer keeps a collection of photographs? What is the term for a book in which an individual or a photographer keeps a collection of photographs? Album. What do you call the place where doctors and nurses work? What do you call the place where doctors and nurses work? Hospital. What is the term for the highest point of a mountain? What is the term for the highest point of a mountain? Summit.
What do you call a person who serves food and drinks to customers in a restaurant? What do you call a person who serves food and drinks to customers in a restaurant? Waiter or waitress. What is the term for a formal speech delivered to an audience? What is the term for a formal speech delivered to an audience? Or Asian. What do you call a small house in the countryside or in a village? What do you call a small house in the countryside or in a village? Cottage. What is the term for a person who makes bread, cakes and pastries? What is the term for a person who makes bread, cakes and pastries? Baker. What do you call a protective garment worn over the front of one's clothes while cooking? What do you call a protective garment worn over the front of one's clothes while cooking? Apron. What is the term for a person who is skilled in making things by hand? What is the term for a person who is skilled in making things by hand? Artisan. What do you call the money paid for a journey on public transportation? What do you call the money paid for a journey on public transportation? Fair. What is the term for a sport in which two teams try to hit a ball over a net without letting it touch the ground? What is the term for a sport in which two teams try to hit a ball over a net without letting it touch the ground? Volleyball. What do you call the person in charge of a ship?
What do you call the person in charge of a ship? Captain. What is the term for a building where scientific experiments take place? What is the term for a building where scientific experiments take place? Laboratory. What do you call a person who investigates and reports news? What do you call a person who investigates and reports news? Reporter. What is the term for a formal agreement between two or more countries? What is the term for a formal agreement between two or more countries? Treaty. What do you call a person who fights fires and rescues people? What do you call a person who fights fires and rescues people? Firefighter. What is the term for a short sleep during the day? What is the term for a short sleep during the day? Nap. What do you call the place where coins are made? What do you call the place where coins are made? Mint. What is the term for a person who flies an aircraft? What is the term for a person who flies an aircraft? Pilot. What do you call a person who makes and repairs wooden objects? What do you call a person who makes and repairs wooden objects? Carpenter. What is the term for a public road in a city or town 
usually with houses and buildings on one or both sides. What is the term for a public road in a city or town, usually with houses and buildings on one or both sides? Street. What do you call the protective outer covering of the human body? What do you call the protective outer covering of the human body? Skin. What is the term for a person who sells goods or services to the public? What is the term for a person who sells goods or services to the public? Retailer. What do you call a vehicle that travels in space? What do you call a vehicle that travels in space? Spacecraft. What is the term for a person who is trained to care for the sick or infirm, especially in a hospital? What is the term for a person who is trained to care for the sick or infirm, especially in a hospital? Nurse. What do you call a person who writes novels, stories or poetry? What do you call a person who writes novels, stories or poetry? Writer. What is the term for the branch of science concerned with the structure and properties of matter and energy? What is the term for the branch of science concerned with the structure and properties of matter and energy? Physics. What do you call the legal dissolution of a marriage? What do you call the legal dissolution of a marriage? Divorce. What is the term for a person who plays sports or engages in physical activity for enjoyment rather than for money?
What is the term for a person who plays sports or engages in physical activity for enjoyment rather than for money? Amateur. What do you call a person who practices medicine or surgery? What do you call a person who practices medicine or surgery? Doctor. What is the term for a person who looks after a building or property when the owner is not present? What is the term for a person who looks after a building or property when the owner is not present? Caretaker. What do you call a person who designs gardens and landscapes? What do you call a person who designs gardens and landscapes? Landscaper. What is the term for a formal meeting for discussion, especially among members of a particular profession or group? What is the term for a formal meeting for discussion, especially among members of a particular profession or group? Conference. What do you call a person who is an expert in the study of insects? What do you call a person who is an expert in the study of insects? Entomologist. What is the term for a written work containing the speeches and songs of a play, opera, or musical? What is the term for a written work containing the speeches and songs of a play, opera, or musical? Libretto. What do you call the person who presides over a court of law? What do you call the person who presides over a court of law? Judge. What is the term for the art and science of designing and managing the construction of buildings and other structures? What is the term for the art and science of designing and managing the construction of buildings and other structures? Architecture. What do you call a person who sells meat?
What do you call a person who sells meat? Butcher. What is the term for a group of words that expresses a complete thought and includes a subject and a verb? What is the term for a group of words that expresses a complete thought and includes a subject and a verb? Sentence. What do you call a person who performs on stage in plays, movies, or television shows? What do you call a person who performs on stage in plays, movies, or television shows? Actor or actress. What is the term for a piece of land used for growing crops or raising animals? What is the term for a piece of land used for growing crops or raising animals? Farm. What do you call the upper interior surface of a room? What do you call the upper interior surface of a room? Ceiling.